Welcome to Grand Cayman. So a little small fact, I have been to this island a million times, even dating back to when I worked on cruise ships five, six years ago. And well, I have never actually gotten off to enjoy Grand Cayman. Why? Because it's what's known as a tender port, meaning in order to actually enjoy the port, you got to wait in a long line, take a ticket, and hopefully eventually maybe get a tender boat over to the Cayman Islands. However, today I am here with my group. We are going to get up nice and early, get some breakfast and get off because today I'm going scuba diving. I do have to go meet up with Lauren and the rest of my group down on deck five. We're going to grab a cookie and some coffee, a little small quick breakfast, and we are going to be going out into the beautiful Grand Cayman. Now, this will be my first time ever scuba diving anywhere other than Cozumel. I heard this area in particular is one of the best places in all of the Caribbean scuba dive. So I'm just super excited. Here we are, deck five. Now, uh, let's see, Lauren should be over here somewhere, I think. What are we gonna get for breakfast? Come on, baby, there she is right here before us. I think I see our group right over here. So they're taking the retreat guests now, and then our group will go after to get on the tender boat. Ooh, Billy, you're late. <laughs> actually, actually. The time has come. To the tender boats we go. Oh, look, free water. Gotta make sure we stay hydrated. On to the tender boat we go. It's Lauren's first time tendering. Now, normally, the reason I don't get off in the Cayman Islands is because when it comes to, like, the tender boats, usually you, you are not the priority. They do all the sweets guests first, and then you gotta get what's known as a tender ticket. Essentially a digital line, and sometimes it can take forever to get off. The advantage of money, I guess. Yeah. See you in a few hours, Celebrity Beyond. Have a great day. As you can see, it wasn't exactly a far trip. There is the ship, Celebrity Beyond. Here's our tender. It was literally a five minute adventure over here. Welcome to the Cayman Islands. Follow the leader. Follow the leader, leader, leader. So now we have about 25 minutes until our shuttle arrives to take us to the boat, which then takes us out to sea to take us scuba diving. So in the meantime, we're gonna do a little bit of exploring. These guys here all have carnival logos on them. I'm assuming that whenever a carnival ship comes into Grand Cayman, this is where they line everybody up for each excursion. Here's a taxi area right off the shuttle port. We're just gonna give you guys a quick scan of the map here. It shows the entire island and what's involved on this island to do. They do have a couple of historical sites, museums, beaches, Stingray City, this is where everybody goes to go kiss the stingrays. Very, very popular site. See, this is what I was talking about. They even have a booth up here. Reef snorkeling, kiss a stingray today. We are now leaving the safety of the cruise port. Hopefully we don't run into any dangers. No, I'm joking, guys. So seriously, we have friends up there that know a guy who knows a guy who knows another guy who is a, a taxi driver, and they always come here to go scuba diving. So that's what we're meeting up with today, and... Well, it's supposed to be a pretty organized day. Let's hope everything goes according to plan. Fingers crossed. Anybody want some freshly caught fish? What kind of fish are those anyway? So while we're waiting, everybody's gonna go ahead and grab a drink. Except for me, because we all know that it's, it's not advisable to drink before going scuba diving. It's actually against the law, I think. What do you want? No. All right, yeah, come on, give me this thing. Our chariot awaits. Pirate divers. Arg. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the beautiful Lisa. and She's taking us on an adventure. Woo! We made it! I'm very excited. This is gonna be a great time. There's our boat! Come on up! So we have everything needed for today's dive. We have plenty of fins. We have all the tanks here. Now I will be doing Discover Scuba first because I am not certified. So I'll be over here learning all the basic lessons before we get into the water and have a great time. Of course we gotta make sure we're doing this legitimately. I have to sign my life away. So this is where we're going today, guys. We are going to a shipwreck. I'm so excited to go for my fourth dive. Miss Lisa's going to take this young man through his Discover Scuba theory. That's me. So anybody who needs a floaty uh, can grab one off Lisa. Stay within the white buoys, and the ship is literally going to be just in front of where the boat is. So it's like 10 feet. So I do have to do my instructory class first in order to go scuba diving. However, since we are near a shipwreck and we're going to be doing other stuff as far as me with the scuba diving, I'm going to snorkel first. And I have my GoPro here so you guys can see what's down there. And then after that, I'll get to the scuba diving. Hey. Jeff, are you ready to jump? Yeah, but do you want to go scuba diving today? I'm going to scuba dive because there is no fun with me. Oh, uh, yeah. Look, scuba one, if you're watching, she only will dive with you. That's it. We do have the pros getting ready here. And I believe, Jen, you said it's your 100th dive? 100th dive, 
Congratulations, that is amazing. Look guys, I wanna be like these two when I grow up. I am not joking. <laughs> and there she goes from her 100th dive. Lucky. And off they go. See you guys in four hours. We got our fins on. Mask is good to go. Well, you just call me Scuba J today. <laughs> try to catch me. Come on, come on, try to catch me. Try to catch me. <laughs> you cannot catch me. Na, 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 na. You just getting my mask defogged, and after that, we're good to go. Bye, Lauren. Au revoir. A bientôt. A tout à l'heure. Yay. Now it's my turn. Camera's all wet Woo! from all that wet water. <laughs> not gonna certify you to dive. So you're not gonna be a certified diver after this Ooh. is a resort. Oh. It's a resort course. And then I'm gonna purge it. It's gonna feel like a blast of air in there. That will clear the water out of your regulator. Hand, not all the way up, but just one hand up. If you're having discomfort, try again. I feel good. So she gave us the instructions. Now I have gone over the instructions before, but now I have a, a pop quiz. Before we actually get into the water. Spaces during descent, I will need to blow gently and against pinched nostrils. True. I should equalize every few feet. True. If I have discomfort in my ears or signs. You wrong. passed them. <laughs> I For did. For real? You passed. Well, I passed the test with flying colors. Now it's time to go ahead and get into the water. So, ladies and gentlemen, out there we have Coral and Lauren. Here is going to take my GoPro. And she's going to record while I'm doing my basic scuba instructions. So far, definitely not a bad day. <sighs> I really did miss scuba diving. Oh, I did the purge button. That's going to be one of those skills you're going to be doing. Looks amazing and ready to go. <laughs> Regulator in your mouth. <laughs> and then the right hand is going to be on the mask and the right tighter. Yeah. <laughs> well, the training is done, so now I'm officially good to go diving with an instructor. So we're going to go ahead and head over to some deeper water where there is also a shipwreck. So we've made it. we got another dive down in that direction. About 20 feet deep is the start of the wreckage and some coral reefs. But this water is about 40 feet deep. Under the sea. Under the sea. Well, the dive was fun, but unfortunately my GoPro didn't make it. I should have got the cage. It, look, it, it's gone. It's done. <laughs> you see? One oh, hundredth dive! Yes. Congratulations! Hundredth dive, and maybe if if we drop that flag, you have to go back in hundred first. Yeah, hundred and one. <laughs> That's gonna be the naked dive. Hundred and one. <laughs> well, that was great. Time to head back. And we are back. Well, other than my GoPro breaking, it was a pretty good day, wasn't it? It was amazing. Yeah, it was a good time. I it was a good time. I took a nap. Hey, I don't know how you do that. She somehow somehow manages to take a nap anywhere, everywhere. And when you can't, it's... you can't. When you're tired, tired. You have to take your little nap. You're a strange one. Very strange. Hey, look, chickens! By the way, a little nugget of information. You see these buses here? They are always on the go. They come around every five minutes or so, and they can charge you as low as a dollar per ride from here all the way back over to the ship. Yes, they always got everything ready. Thank you so much. So we're all showered and rested from our crazy day over in Grand Cayman. Unfortunately, my equilibrium is still a little off. I'm still waiting for this ear to pop here from diving today. I'm still upset about my GoPro. But either way, we're gonna go ahead and get some dinner and well, have a great night. This is such a beautiful area. So today we're just gonna go ahead and go to the main dining room. Tonight we're going to the Tuscan restaurant. And I think they have lobster night here tonight, I believe. So I'm not gonna be doing too much filming here because I do want to enjoy my dinner, but I'm gonna give you guys just a little sample of what they have to hear at the Tuscan restaurant. It's starters, entrees, and of course they got signature cocktails. And then for the starters, a salad, smoked tomato bisque, and then we also have lobster tail. The lobster tail is an additional price tonight. I think it's an extra $16, and then they have the classic entrees and starters as well for you. Cheers. Chin chin. Food's here. Lauren got lamb T-bone, and it didn't stand a chance. She's already tearing it up. I'm guessing it's good, baby. It is good, and the potatoes are cooked with duck fat. Duck fat potatoes. Yeah, I almost got that. And I just, I'm a very simple man. I got the lobster. I couldn't resist. It looks good. I just need some butter. Well, dinner was actually pretty good. It wasn't bad. Lauren got the lamb T-bone steak thing. I should have got that. It looked yep. delicious. I win this time. 
only this time. Now we got to go ahead and go to Latin night. They got some salsa thing going on. Then we have another show that we have to check out. There it is, Latin night. Why isn't anybody on the dance floor? Now we are going to see the final production show here on board the Celebrity Beyond. Hey guys, how you doing? Good evening everybody, hi! hi. Alright, let me hear a 90,000 people, hola! How was your day in Grand Cayman? You had a good day, yes? The show was really, really, really good. Now off to the club. Here we are. The club. Live paintings.
so last night actually got a little wild. Somehow a golden retriever showed up on the dance floor and challenged me to a break dance battle. Lauren was all over the place dancing and, and gyrating all over the place. It was a good it was a good night. Uh, I'll be honest, it was a good night, right? It was a good night. Now, guys, I am going to get ready to wrap this video up here, of course, because it's the next day and we have some exploring to do. It's our last day here on board Celebrity Beyond. However, as usual, I will be uploading a very thorough and detailed review on my main channel, The Ship Life, so make sure you go check that one out. I also have other vlogs coming up on my previous two Virgin cruises in the past couple weeks. And then, in a couple weeks, I'll be going over to Greece to go on Virgin's newest ship, the one I actually I was supposed to be working on last year, The Resilient Lady. So make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to my main channel, subscribe to this channel, hit that like button on your way out, and know what usual that I love and appreciate every single one of you. This is my last vlog for this series. However, you guys know I got plenty more videos coming up. And well, stay tuned. I'll see all of you later. Take it easy. Take it easy. That one was, that was kind of weak. Well, I win this one. I it, just, it, it's okay. She's hungover. Take it easy, guys.